Producers are still on a learning curve as they evaluate the stacks decision. However, while the number of stacks policies is fairly low across the cotton belt, the acreage insured by stacks is significantly higher. So it appears that larger producers may have been more likely to purchase a stacks policy. Adoption rates were low in Texas, but many Texas growers may have decided to select the yield exclusion option instead of stacks. In Texas, more years could be excluded as compared to some of the other states, and producers may have decided to spend additional premium dollars on the yield exclusion option instead of opting for stacks. Some growers will need to see stacks work for at least a year before making a purchase decision. The National Cotton Council continues to support farm policy that provides support to growers without impeding the flow of cotton to the market. The challenge is to craft the best safety net with increasing budget pressures and increased scrutiny from those outside of agriculture and in the trade policy arena.